All right, guys. Huge improvement from yesterday. If you saw yesterday's video, look, he's look at him. He's not floating right back up either. He's just eating off the bottom for the first time in two months. Show the top of that. And he's down pretty far. Guys, we are just so happy that he is doing good. He lost his eyeball for anybody that doesn't know. Two, about two months ago or so, close to two months ago, and. About a week after that, I was feeding him flakes, and he got swim bladder because I didn't let him smash in his eye on the bottom. And he just pooped out all that black stuff last night. So I read online, oh, if your fish doesn't get over swim bladder in two weeks, give up on him or euthanize him or stab him with a needle. That is not true because two months later, this little guy, he's doing his thing. Um, we Actually, he's pretty big. He's... Big, as big as my hand if you check out the other videos Look, but you know, he's doing so but you could see from floating where his fin started to burn from being stuck out of the water for so long he wasn't upside down luckily but he so definitely he couldn't go down bad. but he could not go down I, I we've been doing physical fish therapy with him and pushing him down at least a couple times a day three four times not to stress him out too much but and uh, I'm treating him with salt. And today is by far the best he's ever done in the last two months. Come say like, hi. He was just swimming all the way down at the bottom. He's floating in the water. He was just eating off the bottom. So, yeah, clean water. And, I mean, we tried fasting him for a week. We gave him peas for weeks. We, I pretty much had to feed him flakes because he wouldn't eat pellets because they all sank. And finally, once I started giving him flakes, uh, he started getting his energy back. So, don't if if the fasting doesn't work at first, don't keep fasting him. Uh, it's at that point I believe this was an infection of some sort. I don't believe it was a parasite because he's the only fish that's ever been in this tank, and he's three years old. I, Unless parasites can just magically appear. But I do believe it was probably an infection. And the salt. Right now he's at about two tablespoons per three gallons. And that seems to have wiped it right out. So. The only thing I was worried about was that live plant. And the plant seems to be pretty hardy. And he's got his algae that he can munch on. Actually it looks like he ate a lot of it. It used to be completely dark. So, and a lot of it's from us doing water changes, knocking it off, but, yeah, come on down, bub, come on, well, he just didn't, I mean, he's not floating, there he goes, so, good news for all you guys that watched for the goldfish, and another thing I wanted to say is, we do everything on this channel, and a lot of people will subscribe because they see either a cooking video or me working on something or a rescue animal video and then they'll just unsubscribe when they see something else I don't you guys don't unsubscribe just go to the playlists everything is in playlists so if you don't want to watch everything just check out the playlists uh, we thank you guys for watching and God bless y'all have a good night say bye bubby blub blub bye guys